When dividing a polynomial p of x by a binomial of the form x minus c, where c is a real number, we can use synthetic division. Synthetic division is a simplified version of long division and is best explained through an example. So suppose I have a polynomial p of x that needs to be divided by the binomial uh, x minus 1. That means that c in our case is equal 1. We'll start with writing the polynomial p of x, which is the dividend in the standard form in the order of decreasing powers of x. If you look at our polynomial, it is already in the standard form. Then we'll write the coefficients of that um, polynomial in the order they come in that standard form. So the coefficients are, leading coefficient is 1, then we have 8, 11, and negative 20. To the left of that list of the coefficient, we write our value of c, which is 1, and between the c and the list of coefficient, we'll draw the division symbol. Now we are ready to perform synthetic division. So we we'll leave a little bit room and we'll draw a horizontal line. The division, synthetic division is done in the following way. We'll start with rewriting the leading coefficient below the horizontal line in the same column. So we'll write 1 in here. Next will multiply c by that number in the uh, position under the uh, um, horizontal line. We multiply this, so 1 times 1 is 1, and we'll write it in the second column under the second coefficient. So that's going to be 1. At this point, we'll add those two numbers and write it below the horizontal line, uh, and that is 9. And we'll repeat the process. We'll take 1, the c, multiply by 9, which is 9, and write it underneath the third coefficient. And then we'll add those coefficients. So we'll have here 20. And we'll do it again. 1, the c, multiply by 20 and write below the last coefficient, negative 20. And add those coefficients. That's going to be 0. We'll get a list of numbers, and the last, last number below that horizontal line is the remainder. So this number will be always remainder. Let's call it R of x. And the first three numbers or remaining numbers are coefficients of the quotient. So these numbers form coefficients of the quotient. Quotient written in a, um, in a standard form. Therefore, we can say that q of x, since I have three coefficients, the q of x is the polynomial of the second degree. q of x is going to be x squared plus 9x plus 20. And the remainder, r of x, is 0. Therefore, if we use the uh, regular um, quotient notation that includes dividend divisor, quotient and um, remainder, we can write that x cubed plus 8x squared plus 11x minus 20, which is the dividend, divided by x minus 1, which is the divisor, equals the quotient x squared plus 9x plus 20, plus the remainder over the divisor which becomes simply the quotient.
We can write it also in different way by multiplying both sides by x minus 1, and that means that we'll write x cubed plus 8x squared plus 11x minus 20 is equal quotient, which is x squared plus 9x plus 20 times x minus 1.